ain't no stopping us. Hey guys, what's up? Jeff here again to orient your fitness in the right direction. So today I'm gonna be talking to you guys about how the memory foam pillow, or this thing right here, I'm gonna be talking to you about how it can help you both sleep better and feel better in your life. Because your sleep position is actually very important even though you may not even realize it. Because you could be doing everything else in your life correctly. You could be walking around with perfect posture, you could be exercising in the gym with perfect form, but if you're not sleeping in a correct position for many hours each day, that's going to cause problems over time. Let me give you an example of a bad sleep position that can cause problems over time. Many people, they sleep on their side, and when many people, they sleep on their side, they leave a space between their neck and the pillow. So there's a space between their neck and the pillow. So when this happens to people, what can tend to happen is their head can tend to fall to that side if there's a space there. So what do you think is going to happen if you're in that position for hours at a time? What's going to happen is the muscles here are going to get stretched and the muscles on this side are going to get tight. And that's causing a muscular imbalance right there. So muscles that side bend your head to the same side, which can include muscles like your upper trapezius, your levator scapulae, your scalenes, these muscles that side bend your head to the same side, they can get tightened here and more loose over here. So if you're very tight over here, that can lead to problems like tension headaches, it can lead to shoulder pain, neck pain, it can potentially lead to trapped nerves because when your scaling muscles are very tight, it can affect a nerve bundle called the brachial plexus that originates from your neck and travels all the way down your arm to your fingers. It has branches all the way down. So if you're getting entrapment up here due to your scaling muscles being very tight, it can lead to symptoms like nerve symptoms like pain, tingling, numbness, and burning sensations traveling down your arm, which isn't very pleasant, obviously. So essentially what you want to do is you want to sleep with a neutral cervical spine. Your cervical spine is your spine at your neck, that portion. So you want to sleep with your head not too far down, not too far up, not side bent, you want a neutral spine that's going to allow you to pretty much sleep better and feel better. And what's really good about the memory foam pillow is that it has a contour to it like this. So it has a contour, it comes down like that, it's not flat. A flat pillow might not adequately support you in that position, but a contoured pillow can. Because it, it, it being contoured, it goes right into your neck like that. And now that's giving you adequate support because of that contour. And it's very comfortable too, which I really like. It's very comfortable. So you can sleep like that. If you fold up a regular flat pillow, you might not be being adequately supported. You could lose that position throughout the night if you change position. But this pillow, it really it gives you a lot of support. I really like it. I just started recently using it. And I really like it, it's a great pillow. So essentially to sum things up, it gives you great support when you're sleeping on your side, it supports you when you're sleeping on your back. The worst position by far to sleep in is on your stomach, because if you sleep with the pillow right in your head, like that, you can't breathe, you're gonna suffocate. So pretty much don't sleep on your stomach because you gotta rotate your head. That's gonna create those muscle imbalances that I talked about. You want to sleep with a neutral spine. So sleep on your back, sleep on your side, don't sleep on your stomach. And the memory foam pillow is great for giving you the support that you need to avoid problems that are caused by bad sleeping position. All right guys, hopefully you found that video informative. This has been Jeff once more, orienting your fitness in the right direction. If you liked that video, please sum it up, comment on the video, and subscribe to my channel. And until next time, I'll see you guys later.